Mae rhaglun ymchwil ac arloesi fwyaf erioed yr undeb Ewropeaidd, horizon i gain i gain, ar agor ac yn cynnig cyfleoedd i sefydliadau Cymru fod ar flaen y gad yn y byd ymchwil ac arloesi. Mae crynodeb ystadegol diweddaraf y Comisiwn Ewropeaidd sy'n rhoi sefyllfa ar 31 o 2 2017 yn dangos bod sefydliadau Cymru wedi llwyddo i sicrhau 76 miliwn ewro o gallud erbyn hyn. Dyma rai o'r uchaf bwyntiau. Mae 162 o sefydliadau ac unigolion o Gymru wedi cymryd rhan yn y horizon i gain i gain. Mae mwy na 1600 o enghreifftiau o gydweithredu rhyngwladol gan sefydliadau o Gymru yn horizon i gain i gain. Mae'r sector addysg uwch yn dal i wneud yn dda ac wedi sicrhau 49 miliwn ewro hyd yma. Mae'r sector preifit wedi denu bron i 16 miliwn ewro ac mae nîm yn un enghraifft o lwyddiant. Nîm Biotech is a life sciences organisation based in Abbot Aleri in Wales. Nîm's prime focus is antimicrobial development and we're very proud to be about to be moving into our first clinical trial for a first-in-class anti-infective. Neem is the work program leader um, of the work, first work program, which is quite specifically focused on the biorefining of active compounds. And this is on the basis of Neem's extensive experience in extraction of high-value chemicals from plants and plant waste. And as well as our extensive experience in the development of antimicrobial compounds. NEEM has been part of collaborative projects for many years and the reason why we do that and the reason why quite specifically collaborative projects across the European Union are so important to us is for us to develop relationships with the leading scientists and leading SMEs in our, in our area that allow us to develop our resources um, develop our staff and develop our capabilities. We see this as an opportunity for our organization to have the right skills and the right partners to bring products to the market. Access to funds through collaborative projects has always been a way of us to be able to develop expertise and the Fungus Chain project in in particular has allowed us to actually hire extra expertise into the organization that we would not have been able to do prior to the project. It's also allowed us to expand our technical resources and hence beyond this project we now have skills and infrastructure that we can use for other things in the future. At the end of the project we hope to have achieved three outcomes. The first one is to have developed new extraction technologies which is what we've been doing for so many years and what we hope to protect with patents, to have discovered new antimicrobials that we can put into our development pipeline for potential future drugs. But most importantly, I think the outcome of this project needs to be the fact that we're aiming to use a waste product that's currently being used as a fertilizer that can add significant value to an entire industry.